What's up everybody? It's another morning. It's Saturday. Yeah, gotta go check on Alfie. He's pretty happy to see me. And uh, yeah, it turns out Alfie doesn't like the elevator. Like he's been, always been pulling away from the elevator. And it's to go down these stairs that I didn't know existed. So uh, yeah, doing our morning walk. Walking along Blur Street for a little bit. Here's what Honest Ed's looks like right now. Just a little construction update. Yeah, we headed over to Christy Pitts again. Let him walk around. Yeah, rolling in the grass. He also laid in the puddle. And I did not like that. And, uh, yeah, Arthur came to meet up with us. Uh, he's kind of got the whole day free. Dandy's at some like all day event and uh, he was just gonna wander around. So, yeah, gave out the, his bath because of that puddle time. Now just hanging out. Don't really have any plans today. Alfie, he's uh, pretty much just napping. He's a napping kind of dog, you know, after you hang out with him. Around noon though, we went over to 32 Chicken Street, got some chicken sandwiches, they're alright. Then I went back to France, I did some laundry, and uh, yeah I don't show it but I did clean out the lint trap and stuff, but otherwise we watched like a whole season of Bob's Burgers. Now it's in the afternoon. And uh, Arthur's gonna go meet up with Dandy. I went home quick and had a shower. I was feeling kind of gross after, uh, you know. And uh, yeah, it's Nuit Blanche. So, it's pretty early right now, so there's huge lines for everything. Like whatever this uh, tunnel of lights is. Met up with Arthur again. We're near the ROM. And uh, they have a thing going on, but. You're not allowed to bring in a water bottle, so we're just like, fuck it, let's just leave. And, uh, yeah, over at this church, there's these, uh, people playing drums and stuff. That was pretty cool. We met up with Adam, who also listened to the drums. And, uh,. They had other performances as well. Honestly, I think we spent like half an hour this year. Kind of longer than I thought we were going to. And uh, yeah, we walked by to this uh, bank light display. Which, I always like seeing that thing. But we commented, we were like, it would be neat if they set it up so it was like a video. And like, if you stood in front of it, it would show that. But uh... Yeah, we're at like a different thing. This is kind of weird. It's just like a bunch of school kids taking apart a birdhouse made out of mirrors. And then there's a room that you could draw on if you wanted to. And here's the whole picture. Um, uh, like walking into the building was neat because you go through an alley and then like go through the building. Which was honestly cooler than the actual art display. Here's Ghost School. Which is just like, I guess next to a school, they have some pictures of dead people. I mean like, they're regular pictures, but everybody in there, you know, they're old pictures and I assume they died. And they had pretty Gatorade that I drank. That was alright. We've met up with Dandy now. She's like finished with her event thing. She won a contest, but she had to give a presentation and she's feeling kind of sick from being nervous about the presentation. So yeah, we just chilled out at her house for a bit until we hit the town again. But yeah, we're walking to Nathan Phillips Square on the way. 
There's some of uh, these blue things. Kind of like butterfly wings or dragonflies. Oh, that's pretty nice. And here's a bunch of idiots lined up for free Tim Hortons coffee. Come on, guys, don't waste your time. In a huge line. Again with this huge line to go into the underground parking area to see whatever this exhibit is. We did not wait in that line. Instead, we're just walking through a huge crowd. I like it when the displays are big enough that you can still see it in a big crowd. Yeah, here's the Dumpling Festival. And the, the actual street part is so crowded here. On the back, it's not as crowded, but you know, you can't buy anything there. And uh, there's a display at the Eaton Center Bridge thing, which at the time I'm like, where is it even? Because, I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. And over at the Cloud Gardens, there's some people like on that big walkway thing. I wasn't sure if that was a permanent thing. But yeah, they had a microphone set up and the sound controls the lights that are in the park here. Kind of neat. I'm not sure what this was. It's like a DJ on Bay Street. It's a bunch of fake police cars. And back at the square. Kind of wondering what that orange thing is. But here somebody's done what I was talking about. Like, it's just a camera and then it uh, has a fun light display of the people that are in front of the camera. Yeah, pretty crowded here. I don't know if there was anything like actually in the square. Yeah, and that hot air balloon again is here. We're kind of near this orange cube, but it's so crowded. We're never going to get in there. But what's in there, you know? What's in that orange cube? Yeah, it's about uh, midnight-ish now. You know, people are getting kind of tired. But honestly, kind of want to go back when it's not so crowded. See what's in that orange box. So, tune in next time to find out.